Okay, we'll talk about the newest app na kalaban ng Grab, that's Auto. Let me go ahead and download that since I'm curious. So on my, my Android phone, I'll go ahead and download. There are three login methods. Uh, you can choose Facebook, Google account, or phone number. This time, I will choose phone number. And then for the phone number, you will be sent uh, a verification number via text. And you just have to put the uh, verification code. I already have Grab app, see? I have a free uh, Grab food, del free delivery. Anyway, I'm, I'm just curious, that's why I'm trying it out. So for Oto, O-W-T-O, here we go. This is the create profile. So it's kind of easy because uh, it's only asking like um, uh, three main um, information. That would be your name, which is composed of first name and last name, email address, and the phone, uh, I mean the photo. Photo is required before you can finish the profile part. So for the email address though, um, the app itself can identify if you are putting in uh, a valid email address. Okay, so while we're waiting for it to finish typing the email address, uh, sorry for that just because um, the phone that I'm using is kind of old. So yun touch screen niya, hindi na ganong gumagana. But anyway, so uh, later part of this video, I, sh uh, I will show you the difference uh, as far as fare is concerned. Uh, yung pinakaiba ng if you use Grab app compared to the auto. So same location lang, so same pickup point and drop off. Um, and then let's see kung ano yung pinakaiba nila. Uh, pagdating sa price. Uh, this is just um, okay. I'm sorry. It's it's actually a typo error again. Yung keys are are not that perfect. So that's the error message when when you skip the the photo part. It will definitely require. So I decided to put my son's picture, and there you go. So this is where you book. A ride, and I will choose the e terminal two, so it doesn't even have like a lot of options under terminal two. Whereas, pag kinompare mo sa Grab, there are a lot of options sa terminal two palang. And then I will choose for the drop off uh, that would be Mall of Asia, the one on Pacific Drive. So for Auto, uh, they have three options uh, for a ride. So, yung parang class type ng ride. So, they have the uh, premium. So, ang counterpart niya sa Grab is the Grab car. So, it's four seaters right there. Auto premium, it's 192 pesos it said. And then, auto more, which is ang counterpart nito is yung six seater ng Grab. That's 225.37, and then the class one, which is the premium counterpart in sa, sa Grab. And so so far, right now, tatlo lang ang options na meron sila. So this is the menu page right here, the one you're seeing. They have promos, so you will get like voucher, 20 pesos voucher for any successful uh, referral or refer a friend program. And then for your account, you can schedule a ride. And for payment, uh, you can have a cash or a card option. And dark map, I'm not really sure what's the, what that is. So again, this is the first time I, I had like a, a look of this app. Okay, so 109.256 for the premium. And then uh, just like uh, what Grab have before or I, I, I guess until now they have it first ride you will have like 100% uh, 100 pesos off from grab and then for auto it's 20% off okay so let me go ahead and try to book uh, same uh, pick up point and drop off this time this uh, from grab so from the grab app uh, for Naia terminal 2 I chose the grab booth 
uh, just because it's kind of evident kasi na uh, eh, ba hindi ka magkakamali grab boost yan so marami kasi dun bay 1 bay 3 whatever and then I'll choose mode of Asia Pacific Drive and let's see how much would it be right there so 192 from auto compared to grab app which is 210 so ang kinaganda lang sa grab is that they have a lot of options and I think uh, it's user friendly and maraming kukuha kasi marami ng, maraming mga drivers sa kanila but anyway whatever fits you guys thank you so much for watching please don't forget to click on like and subscribe